वेलकम टू द गैलरी ऑफ हेल्थ एंड डिजीजेस पार्ट फोर सो आफ्टर द डिफरेंट डिस्कशन ऑन द इम्यूनिटी एंड इम्यून सिस्टम वी आर नाउ सजेस्टिंग सेवरल अदर इन्फेक्शस डिजीज सम ऑफ द डिजीजेस आर रिंग वर्म इन्फेक्शन Commonly, these ringworm infections are caused by fungi. These fungal group of populations include a common term, dermatophytosis. Within the category of dermatophytosis, several species are included, such as Microsporum. such as trichophyton such as epidermophyton so they indicate different type of infectious diseases on skin specially which include itching which include different types of rashes which include different type of other allied disorders supposed to be associated with skin disorders like lesions on skin hemorrhagic spots and commonly these terminologies are very much in use such as tinea cruris such as tinea manum such as tinea palpis such as tinea barberis the infections are 100% curable and they are one of the disturbing diseases of human being obviously next group of pathogenicity comes on allergic rhinitis rhinitis is nothing but a type of disorder associated with running nose headache bronchospasm associated with chronic obstructive bronchitis also the pathogen include the smallest bacterium dialister pneumocystis and one of the very serious most virus rhinovirus the pathogens are mostly coming through air someone's cough was previously affected and allied group of infections coming from different other sources actually these diseases the short of diseases are not so much infectious but to some extent infectious causing several disorders associated to it so the fundamental immunogenic responses are related to this type of infections now one of the greatest pathogen now i'm going to describe is aids as the name you all know that is acquired immunodeficiency syndrome caused by hiv human immunodeficiency virus and this virus is supposed to be a very important virus we call it retrovirus that makes a very important event while introduced into the host cell that they are carrying rna by way of reverse transcriptase action they are making dna and that is the main pathogenic change what a cell used to be expressing whenever the retrovirus is attacking the body there is a chance of a typical rna induced dna conversion and the dna is now attacking the host dna called this dna as provirus and provirus makes many copies of dna which is supposed to be associated with different disorders and they are making several diseases like kaposi's sarcoma lympho adenopathy 
associated with several non-target infections such as tonsillitis and wasting syndrome such as loss of body weight associated with aphasia that means loss of appetite. Thank you. For testing your understanding of this lesson and more videos, log on to www.tubelessons.net.